Hello friends, welcome back to my trading channel. Today we are going to discuss about how to trade with the support and resistance levels. All these levels I was posted on my telegram channel today morning just before market opened. Those who didn't join my telegram channel yet, please click the link below in the description box and join it. Okay, as usual we got three stocks today, Can Bank, Bank Baroda and Petronet. Let's see the performance of support and resistance level today. The first one we got Can Bank. Uh, can bank the resistance level is 226.15 and 223.85 okay morning we got these levels just before market open after that as usual opening five means we are not doing any trade you just watch it uh, 920 onwards our trade will be start okay the first candle itself it they break the 223.85 level and it comes down so as per our strategy once any candle close below the support level then we are going for sell okay as per this next candle opening we are going to sell that is 222 levels we are going to sell but after that it didn't go up or down it will be in the stage of consolidation let's skip it will be in the stage of consolidation after two o'clock it will be break the support level and close above the support that means it's a buy signal comes then we are gone for buy here if, if we, we are sell here but we are exited there and again we are go for buy because it's a close above the support level but it didn't go up instead of it comes down but the next candle is red but the candle is close above the support level then also we can wait but the next candle is break the support and close below the support then we are go for sell signal then exit the buy and go for the sell and this sell we got a profit here see 223.452 this comes below 220 level okay so whatever loss we made here this trade helped to recover that loss and next one bank baroda see bank baroda also you can see the first candle itself it break the support and the resistance level is 105.30 and 103.70 these are the support and resistance level we got today morning and 103.70 it's a break the first candle break 103.70 and close below the level that means we are going for sell but the next candle is break the support but it didn't close above the support in case if the candle is close above the support then we are go for buy but in this case it is close below the support then we can hold the sell and it comes to 103.152 it comes down to 102.50 it said didn't get a good movement today then again it goes up and see it just touched the support level didn't break it just touched and comes down and next candle you can see there is a signal for red then we can go for sell here the reason is it touched the support now it's act as a resistance once support is break again it's act as a resistance so it's trying to break this resistance but it's failed and next, uh, next candle is a red that is the indication of sell so just uh, when the candle is closed here then go for sell here the candle is red that's why i say that it's a sell and that will be comes down today we didn't get much movement on these stocks but you once you monitor closely see what happened once it's touch these levels it's just touch this level and comes down here also it goes up but touch the level and comes down that's why these levels are very powerful so you just draw these levels on chart and don't do any trade till it touch the level till market touch those levels uh, once any of this candle touch this level then watch it closely and take the decision for buy and sell okay and next one is petronet all these three stocks we got today petronet is 216.50 that's the resistance and 212.20 unfortunately it didn't touch any of these levels support or resistance is the trade inside the range so there is a not trade okay so hope you get some idea about how to trade with the support and resistance levels every day i try to post this 
support and resistance level and making video also then you will get some idea about how to trade with this support and resistance level and if you feel that this type of videos and this type of levels are helpful for you just comment it and if you uh, if you feel that this is not useful for you that also you can comment it in the this, uh, comment box so your feedback is very important for me then only i can improve these videos and most of the people were asking me how to get these levels actually this is the level is based on some calculations uh, see i just based on previous candles based on previous candles i draw this level support and resistance level okay and my own calculation is also be there it's hard to explain through video that's why but every day you will get the levels on telegram channel you just follow that levels and i will try to make videos on every day uh, that will be helpful for learning okay hope you like this video if you have any doubt do send a mail to nicholas miller 2017 at gmail.com also visit my website nicholas miller.com thank you thank you for watching i will be back with another trading video till then have a nice day bye bye